Good afternoon. I wanted to come online and share something today. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. I'm walking up a hill, so. Hmm. Okay, so I want to talk about investing and and how vital it is to invest and what investing actually means so i had the opportunity to go to my village in ghana and say, Ooh, there's a fly i'm okay I'm, I'm okay to go to my village in ghana and visit visit there which I hadn't been there for over 10 years when I last went there I was a child and so there's this classic place called the, the crocodile pond if you're in that region you'll know about it because it's like a destination, a place you go to if you're in that region of Ghana because the crocodiles have spiritual significance to most of the people and they were found there like in the 1600s or something and um, so this pond, when I last went there as a child the place was beautiful to my memory it was green it was lush the water was clean and it was a, a well kept space 10 plus years later we come we go to have a similar experience and the place had been run down was was not attractive the people who were looking after the place were as run down as the place the people were as run down as the place not you know honor to them they were pleasant and we done a and done a fine job but you can tell when people are run down or not so and I was just shocked that it was the same place because it felt like a completely different place and that was just 10 plus years later and the lesson from that is that my god like in life you have to maintain things you have to put consistent effort into protecting and caring for and loving the things that matter to you because that's our job I mean if we go by the religious books I'm not religious in the traditional sense but but like we're here to steward the earth and it's obvious because when there's a place and then because of our lack of care and attention or our bad behaviour to an environment it really shows and so that we're definitely here to steward the earth because when we're not stewarding it we're not stewarding it if things will look bad um, okay so that's the lesson in that and tying that into investment maintenance and stewardship is investment Investing your time, your energy, your resources, your knowledge into anything Stop that. Sorry about that. is investment, is an alarm to say solidarity and unity among all the children of Africa throughout the universe. Solidarity and unity throughout among all the 
children of Africa throughout the universe. Solidarity and unity among all the children of Africa throughout the universe. That's something that I came across from a video I was watching. Um, Dr. Bayina Bella and a lady who, who uh, put that initiative forth in an event that they were both in at 12 12 every day. You, no matter what you're doing, you stop and you meditate on that unity. So that's what the alarm is for because it's happening in other videos as well. So you can join the 12 12 unity <laughs> society. Um, that yes, investing is very important, and so coming to the the crutch the crutch of this video is that if you are working full time as an African person in the West or in any place where the currency is much higher, and you are not and you have no investments in Africa, something's wrong. Something's definitely wrong you have to change that there's a lack of knowledge there's a lack of awareness there's a lack of understanding there's a lack of self-respect these are all the things that are inculcated into us being raised in the west there's an ignorance complete disconnect from reality of who we are thinking we're all this we're all that you cannot be working full time and not have land an investment something in this day and age there is no way you can be of african descent you are working full time and you don't have any claim any investment on the continent it's not possible you're very out of um you're you're out this you're, you maybe don't know and you haven't been exposed but you need to do that i know if you don't have a reference point is that where do i start vibrate on it because there's many i'm a part of different i'm a part of a group that's doing it so if you're interested in it you will then draw in the the people in the spaces and the groups who are investing in africa who are legitimate who are growing who are the builders in 10 20 years you, um, you'll see the efforts put forth today you know um join my community tour and relocation community this is a seed it's a beginning things are going to continue to be percolating and growing so but i do have if you're interested in investing i'm a part of two different societies so if you're genuinely interested in investing in the continent property let me know and i can just send you content of the two the two um communities I'm a part of but it's very important because if you don't invest in Africa then Africa cannot manifest because we are her steward uh, we were the ones who are stewarding Africa and it's our job and so the example of that I gave was the pond the crocodile pond that was left and became very derelict in a matter of 10 plus years it was very sad it was like a different place and that's because whoever was the steward whatever the situation it went downhill so you can't let that happen to anything you care about and there's no way in god's name that you can be working a full-time job in the west and not have you can there's there's things you can 1,000, 2,000, 3,000 pounds you can get something for yourself you can start something so just have a savings have a saving plus start saving to purchase land, water um, do group real estate whatever, there's different things happening farming just start saving because it's just absolutely asinine for you to be working a full time job and not have any investment in the continent if you are a black person on this continent on this in this planet it it's it makes no logical sense so maybe i can go deeper into it and think more about why 10 reasons why you need to invest but it's not even like that it's just common sense it's like 
it's your Africa is your home it's the future it's the present it's the past it's everything and for you to be so disconnected to not understand that means there's a lack of education and there's some work you need to do on yourself to be able to just understand why that's important so that's the video for today as I'm walking invest in the things you care about maintain be steward to the things you love and care about otherwise your lack of care attention investment does show and there's no one to blame but us so on that note um, um, on that note before I go the tour and relocation community is a com oh, I'll, I'll win <laughs> there was a green and black butterfly but anyway join the tour and relocation community this community is for individuals who are either going to be coming to Ghana moving to Ghana already living in Ghana and they don't have a reference point they don't have family they don't have family or they don't have any community that they're thank you that they're locked into so because of that reason and even if they do have family or they do have a community they're locked into there's certain needs that need to be met let me just go down the stairs this community is for individuals who have who when they come they want to be empowered they have questions they're going to be having experiences they want people they can talk to immediately that they can jump in a whatsapp group and get answers get support put, put in a direction they're never going to feel isolated they want to be a part of something that's going to build the long-term future they want to have investment opportunities they want to um they want to really shorten the learning curve and have emotional psychological support by being able to relate to people who are going through the same experiences that they are going through and so the whatsapp group is a space where a positive space positive vibration we have affirmations we have info information that is technical knowledge whether that's wi-fi whether that's how to get something done how to get this done how to get that done let's say for example how to set up a bank account or the best wi-fi to get in your area or how to do money payment or how do you get service people how do you get a good um how do you get let's say a driver a cleaner or different things that is what the whatsapp group for group is for discussion points we have discussion points we get to share opinions we get to share experiences and relate to one another and then we have the digital meetup that's every month um which again is just a meetup where we can just chat and reference our months if there's any having that community and that communication creates an environment where think imagine 10 years from now connections can be made here where people start companies just by being connected in a community and they collaborated because there was some shared vision so i'm excited for it it started digitally but as things grow i'm excited for it to become like real time as well um Join the community if you're interested. Please email aisha.ajona at gmail.com. That's aisha.ajona at gmail.com. I am very excited for it. Excited to have you. Um, so, signing out. Bye. See you soon.